Well, the man Irving police say is linked to the death of two people inside of a fast food restaurant is in jail. Nicole Nielsen outside of the Chick-fil-A right off North MacArthur Boulevard with what she's learned today about that investigation. This Chick-fil-A location might be closed, but there's still people slowly showing up here today to leave flowers in honor of the two lives lost. Police believe the shooting was a targeted attack. They began receiving 911 calls around 4 p.m. yesterday when 37-year-old Oved Bernardo Mendoza Argueta opened fire inside the same Chick-fil-A where his wife works. He shot and killed two other employees. One of the victims was 49-year-old Patricia Portillo. Police have not yet identified the other victim. The Chick-fil-A's local owner-operator said in part, our hearts are broken by the tragedy that unfolded inside our restaurant on Wednesday. We will miss our two team members dearly. Right now, our focus is on providing care for our team and the victim's families. Argueta was arrested early this morning and charged with murder. Irving police have not confirmed where Argueta is from, but we are told that he has an immigration hold on him, also known as an ICE detainer. Today, people began leaving items for a makeshift memorial outside. Is whatever happened yesterday is very, very sad. Very, very sad because each and every life is very important. And this is a nice and safe area. Currently, Argueta is being held in the Irving jail. As for now, Chick-fil-A has no comment on when this location plans to reopen. In Irving, Nicole Nielsen, CBS News, Texas.